Okay, I'm back. Um, just some more thoughts on the v PS Vita. Um, I keep, I don't know, somebody had to correct me because I kept saying PSP Vita. But, um, I mean, there's a few things that I actually don't like about the system. Um, one is the, well, you can't see it on here because the buttons are not backlit, but two things. The, um, select and start button it's so recessed in the inside of the unit it's like you don't even know if you're pressing it or not and i'm not sure if too many games are actually going to use that select and start or i notice mostly especially in, in Char uncharted most things are like you know th they're done on a touch screen but i mean if you had to press those two buttons it, you good luck with that um another thing is like I think the analog sticks, and just just my in in my opinion, I think the analog sticks are way too close to the buttons. It's way too close to the buttons to where you're accidentally, you know, depending on how you're holding the device, you're gonna be hitting the analog. Um, another thing I didn't like <clears throat> is the browser. I mean, the browser, it's. It's not the best in the world. I mean, I don't expect it to be some old full-fledged Chrome, Firefox, whatever browser. But, I mean, come on. Android, the, the cheapest Android phone with, like, a garbage processor does a better job than this. You know what I mean? So, hopefully they refine that with some type of software update. And another thing is I'm I'm actually disappointed that I did buy the 3G version. Because I just remembered that I had Wi-Fi router in my Android phone, which I have um, HTC Evo 3D. And I just turned the Wi-Fi router on, and guess what? I'm connected to the net. So it's like, you know, I can tether my 4G, and it works just fine. I'm not, I, I know I'm on 3G right now. I'm not tethering 4G. I'm tethering 3G right now, so it's not as fast. But, um, you know, I don't know why this, oh, there we go. I don't know why it's blurry, but, uh, you know, they need to fix this browser, like, ASAP, because, I mean, come on, that's ridiculous. That, that's unacceptable. Um, let's see, anything else? Uh, besides the price of the games, which is another thing I don't like. Um, I guess everything else is okay. I'm not going to really play with this too much. And, uh, of course, until Marvel vs. Capcom uh, 3 comes out. And then, um, I don't know, I'll probably give this thing away. Probably make some type of video. Uh, you know, a contest. I'll think of something to do. And probably just give it away. Because, I mean, I, I think the system is quite large. Honestly, it is. You know, I thought the PSP was pretty, was pretty, uh, you know, pretty good, decent size. Now, I do have, like, a case on it, so that can also add to the bulk of the system, but, um, this thing is pretty large. Uh, um, let me see. I don't know, the, for some reason, the, I do have Bluetooth on my computer. Now, I don't know how this would, um... I don't know, maybe you can transfer files or media share or something like that with Bluetooth, but so far I didn't have any luck with that. My computer, well, this wouldn't connect to my computer. Now, let me see if I can go in here so you can see, like, some of the prices of these games. But I know I'm tethering 3G, so it's pretty slow. Uh, let's see, come on. Like I said, you have to excuse my voice because I am pretty sick. Uh, you know, I mean, within this like thirty-five dollar mark, like twenty-nine to thirty to thirty-five, that's okay. Uh, even forty, if you know, if it's like a really good game, you know, if it's like one of the flagship games and it's forty dollars, that's fine. But I mean, come on, fifty dollars for Uncharted, and I actually, I think the game is. I mean, it looks nice. You know, don't don't get me wrong, it does look nice. But it's, I don't know, me, I brought it just to buy it, but. It's not my kind of game, you know, I don't, it, it doesn't, 
I don't know. It looks I'm, to me, you know, I, I might get bashed for this. You, you might hate on me, but to me, it doesn't look that much better than like a really, really good PSP game. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, there's things that you will see that, you know, PSP is not capable of doing, which is like some of the shadows, you know, uh, some of the detail. But I mean, I don't know. I'm, I am I got Infinity Blade for my iPhone and it it I, to me that looks better than Uncharted. Now, it can be because like this is the first generation of games and, you know, nobody really tweaked the hardware like that. But I mean, I don't know. For that price, I would I was expecting like to be really really blown away like But let me stop complaining about the system cuz I don't want to sound like I'm nitpicking and stuff like that. But I mean, it it does look nice, you know. I guess they don't have too many games out, but that's the game I want. I wanted Marvel vs. Capcom 3. That's actually the only game I wanted in Stardust Delta. So I'm going to I'm in my car right now. As you can see, yes, I have a Pontiac Solstice, and um, I'm gonna go upstairs and probably download a few demos. Uh, I think I downloaded some already, and then um, you know, just play around with it for you know a little little bit, and then I don't know. I guess like once one of my videos reach like 2K views, I'll probably just make a contest where I give it away or something like that you know I don't know I'll think of something but I mean it's still in, in brand new com you know condition I don't I have it in the case I have a screen protector on it so you know there's it's not gonna be any scratches or anything like that so uh I don't know just keep checking back and uh I gotta play around with some of these these other things here and I did take a picture with it the camera's it's not too bad if you ask me. I mean, it's like, you know, typical, you know, like a crappy. Uh, oops, that's my girlfriend. Like a typical, uh, you know, low budget cell phone camera. I mean, I'm pretty sure you're not going to use this to be taking novelty pictures and stuff, but. It's not that bad if you ask me. I don't really use the camera on any of my devices anyway, so. But it's not that bad. Uh, okay, so I'll go and try to get Stardust because I really want to see that game so bad. Oh, I did use the Maps application. I don't know if the GPS is working. Because it didn't, as I was driving, it didn't, like, you know, follow me. I don't know how to get that to work. Because I, I guess it's using <coughs> Google Maps. But I don't know how to, how to get it to navigate. Because there's really not that many options, honestly. So, I don't know, maybe somebody knows something I don't know. But, um, alright, let me stop talking so freaking much. Hey, it's showing my location. Is it? Let's see. I actually just want to see if it's going to show my location. Which I think it's not. Because that's not where I'm at. That's where I was. I was at Wendy's being a fat ass. But, uh... I don't know how to, dig to get it to navigate. Let me see if I press this. What happens? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's where I'm at. Yeah, this is where I'm at, bro. Okay, that's working. But how do you get it to navigate? Uh, uh, I don't know. I'll figure this out. But, um, yeah, just keep checking back. I'll make something else soon. Thanks for watching.